What's up guys, I'm Ita Marenda. In today's tutorial, we're gonna be looking at how to control four DC motors with Arduino Uno using a motor shield driver. So, let's get started. That's the, uh, the motor shield driver. And uh, we've got here three ICs responsible for for controlling uh, the shield. That's the uh, L293D motor driver. Th the second one is the um, 74HC595 shift register. And the last one is also the uh, L293D motor driver. So we can control four DC motors um, and uh, two servo motors at the same time, okay? We can connect the first DC motor to the terminal M1, these two output, and the second motor to the terminal M2, uh, these to in output and the third DC motor to the terminal M3, okay, uh, M3, these two outputs, and the fourth motor to the terminal M4, these two outputs, and the two servers we can connect the first okay on this side uh, and the second using um, uh, these three um, pins okay guys let me show you how to connect the motor shield to the uh, Arduino Uno. the first two pins are connected to pin A5 and uh, Rx, like so. Okay. So in our first demo, we're going to control one single uh, DC motor, and uh, and uh, and uh, after that, we're going to control uh, four DC motors now we're going to use the m3 the the third terminal okay like so now i can connect the uh, my um, Arduino Uno to my laptop like so okay guys um, okay now let's jump into Arduino ID if we want to control the DC motor uh, with the motor shield driver we need to go to tools, boards, boards manager, and uh, we need to install uh, this library. Add, add the fruit model. Okay, uh, so we need to install um, this library, but uh, for me, it's already installed. Now we go. Uh, here and uh, we and uh, we type include we're going to use the uh, uh, this uh, library uh, AF, uh, af motor dot h now we need to create an object called motor 
to control the model. And uh, we, we need to um, specify um, the terminal, okay? Uh, so that this model is connected to, uh, to M3. So uh, we're gonna put here three, okay? Now we, we go, we jump into a void loop function. And um, so we need to um, to type model the uh, object created and the set speed. So it, it's going to to set the uh, the speed of the um, uh, DC model. Let's say um, to hundred and uh, again more, again more, and uh, the function run so that uh, the uh, the model can spin or turn. Okay, so. It's going to to uh, to run for two seconds, and uh, then we write the variable again. Uh, the uh, we write the uh, the uh, object uh, uh, again. Model, and um, we write again run. And we put here release to start the the motor, okay. And uh, we put a delay one second. So the motor is going to stop uh, for one second. Again, we're going uh, we're going to. Um, to change the direction again motor and uh, this time we're going to change uh, the direction okay we put uh, backward okay to change uh, the direction uh, so backward and the delay Delay. The, the delay is going to be, uh, let me see, two seconds. And uh, again, more. After that, we stop the more, the DC more. Okay, for, let me see, for one second. Okay, guys. Okay, now we go to tools. We choose the, uh, the boards is uh, Arduino Uno. Uh, and uh, we go again to tools and we choose the uh, port com four, okay? So to control one single uh, DC model, now we can send, now we can upload the program. We also need to power the, uh, the model shield. So if we are giving power to both Arduino board and uh, to the motor shield, uh, make sure that uh, the, the, the jumper, okay, um, uh, this uh, jumper is not 
connected so we take it out okay and uh, we now we, we can power uh, both uh, boards okay. okay so uh, as you can see that this motor is turning uh, back word and uh, for word okay is working uh, now let us connect uh, for DC motors so um, this one goes to M4 that okay And uh, if this one goes to terminal M, M1. Okay, like so. And uh, that one to terminal M, M3, I mean, uh, to M2. Okay, now let me show you the sketch for controlling uh, the four DC motors. That's the, uh, the sketch and uh, uh, I'm going to put it in the description. Okay, guys. So we go to tools and uh, Arduino boards are uno uh, and so we pick the board arduino con uh, 4 and we can send the program okay it's done Okay, guys, as you can see here, we, we are controlling uh, right now the four DC motors, okay, guys? Okay, so they turn forward and uh, backward. Okay guys, thank you so much and uh, I see you in the next video.